She's just 19 years of age from Nagoya, second in Japanese nationals this year, right at the start of the year, without Asada, of course. This is Rika Hongo. Got to the Grand Prix final last year, did Rika. Finished in sixth place. Similar routine, similar jumps to what we saw from Courtney Hicks. So it'll be should it'll be a flip and toe loop combination at the start here. Yes, and she got a triple at the end. So triple flip, triple toe. Spin. Three legs stayed off. Loving the commitment and the power to this routine. Just outstanding. From first beat to last, love the way the music was interpreted. Music from Cirque du Soleil. And I know when we watch figure skating, we should be looking at the feet all the time. But actually, I was drawn to her arms. I love the way that she demonstrated the performance right the way through. Yes, I, I really, really enjoyed it from the first moment in terms of the approach she took to it. It's not an easy bit of music to own, uh, but we see it time and time again with ladies at the top level that they, they have this strength in their ability to uh, extend the arms and have a powerful presence which matches that music. And it can really fall flat if it doesn't work. It just becomes the backdrop. We've seen that before. Here's the opening. That looked good. I think it was round, I think it was round. Made a real effort in the spins, and I'm surprised when some of the girls don't and kind of throw them away. It was making sure there were level fours within them. There's the flip. And the double axle attacking. I think she could well be looking at second place. So good, obviously in the shadow of Mao Asada, but who knows, still a teenager. 19 as she was in September, so great times could be coming for Riga Hongo. You know, the triple axle carries such a big weight to it. I think psychologically for the judges as well as on a points basis that it, it 
it's one of those things we saw it time and time again with it with the guys really when they when quads first came on the scene when you can land that big element it kind of impacts the overall mark for the whole program and i think that's what's happened here and uh, yeah no one else even attempting that in the ladies as an element so asada way clear 71 73 the mark to aim for courtney hicks 62 38 she's in second place at the moment is it going to be a japan one two after this still two more to go to exceptional young russian talents and i think she's going to be well certainly in the shake-up for a medal that's for sure it's going to be a, a very big day for japan Yes, 65-79, three points clear.